The next few days are the most important in the annual church calendar, and Pope Francis will be busy with services and masses. EWTN News Rome correspondent Colin Flynn joins us now. And Colin, can you tell us more about Pope Francis's Easter schedule at the Vatican this year? Good evening, Eric. I can indeed. Well, the Vatican has published the Pope's schedule for Holy Week at the Vatican. And as you expect, how the liturgies will be celebrated this year will be much more low key than in previous years due to, of course, COVID-19, with most people watching from home on TV. For example, one of the big changes is the Way of the Cross. Now, this is traditionally held at the Colosseum here in Rome, where up to thousands would gather outside to pray with Pope Francis. However, this year it will take place just behind me in St. Peter's Square, instead with only only small groups of faithful allowed to attend. Tomorrow, Holy Thursday, the Pope will celebrate the Chrism Mass in the morning in St. Peter's Basilica, but the Vatican confirmed that he will not preside over the Mass of the Lord's Supper. Instead, Cardinal Giovanni Battista Ray, the Dean of the College of Cardinals, he will preside over that Mass instead. Well, that's still going to be an incredible sight out there. And what about Good Friday? Good Friday, there will be the Papal Liturgy of the Passion of the Lord at 6 p.m. and then Stations of the Cross with Pope Francis at 9 p.m., as we mentioned, in St. Peter's Square. Now, the Pope will offer the Easter Vigil Mass on April the 3rd in St. Peter's Basilica at 7.30 p.m. and he'll also celebrate the Easter Sunday Mass at 10 a.m., after which he will offer the traditional Urbi et Orbi blessing. And Colm, I understand that the Pope has enlisted the help of some Italian scouts at this year's Way of the Cross. That's right, Eric. Pope Francis chose a scouting group from central Italy and kids from a Roman parish to prepare the meditations for this year's Way of the Cross. The Agenzi Folonia Scouts Group from Umbria, made up of 145 young people between the ages of 8 and 19, they've composed the meditations for the Way of the Cross with Pope Francis. And as well as that, an additional group of around 500 kids, Eric, from the First Holy Communion and Confirmation classes at the Roman Parish of the Holy Martyrs of Uganda, they've also helped to prepare them as well. Now, the Way of the Cross, as we said, will be held at 9 p.m. Roman time on April the 2nd. No public attendance allowed this year. However, the good news is that it will be streamed across all of EWTN social media and carried live on EWTN television across the world. Eric? It's a great reminder for our viewers out there. Colin Flint, EWTN News Rome correspondent. Thank you, Colin. Thank you, Eric.